Hi, beautiful. So you've been diagnosed with a bulging disc in your lumbar spine, and you want some tools that you can do at home to help you recover. I've been teaching injury recovery Pilates for over 20 years now. I've helped many people recover from their bulging discs. It's absolutely possible. Your body can recover, your body can heal. You just need some tools in your pocket and consistency. This first tool I'm gonna to show you should feel really good on your spine. It's simple, passive, and should relieve some pain. Let's get to it. Okay, so here you are. <laughs> so all you're gonna do is place a pillow under your belly at the edge of the bed, have your knees bent, resting on your feet, and you're just gonna lower your body down so you're not holding yourself up or anything, and you're just gonna be here and you're gonna let your spine decompress naturally, letting the gravity lengthen your spine. If it's more comfortable for you to keep your shoes on, that's absolutely fine. If you start noticing any tension that you're holding in your legs or your upper body, you just wanna to try to relax as best you can into this position, really letting gravity do its job of traction. Of course, remembering to breathe and just continue to try to relax your body in this position as best you can. And you wanna see if you can be here for about one to two minutes. It may feel like you're doing nothing, but this is one of the most important things that you can do for yourself when you wanna heal your bulging disc. Decompression, creating that space in between your vertebra, allowing for this natural traction in the spine. So even though it may feel like you're not taking a lot of action, you're actually doing something very important for your body. Remember, you're creating that space in between your vertebra, allowing for the disc to come back into more optimal form. Now, after being here for one to two minutes, you wanna very slowly come out of it. So do not move quickly. So go ahead. Lift yourself up slightly and take little baby steps <laughs> to come out of it, right? So nice and easy and slow. So how do you feel after doing that simple traction? Did it relieve some discomfort for you? I certainly hope it helped. You can do this simple traction move several times a day or when you're feeling discomfort in your spine, it can help provide pain relief. And yes, it's true, this pain relief may just be temporary, but please don't let that discourage you. It's perfectly normal. It's part of your recovery process. As you continue through your healing and your recovery journey, your pain-free intervals will become longer and longer and longer. So please stay consistent and don't give up hope. Your body will heal. You will recover. I want you to get the most out of this healing process. So if you have any questions or you're looking for modifications, leave a comment below. I'm happy to help. So FYI, this is part one of four. You can access part two in the description below or possibly at the end of the video. It will be waiting for you whenever you're ready and I will meet you there. See you soon. Are you ready for exclusive content, early access to content and other perks? Join us on Patreon. Click on the link in the description of this post for more. Special shout out to my Vital 7 stars. Thank you for making this video possible.